Forge is a comprehensive framework designed to streamline the creation and installation of mods for Minecraft. In today's video, we're going to go over how to install Forge on a Minecraft server. We'll first go over how to install it through our jar menu tool, and then we'll go over how to install it manually. First, we're going to log into our Bicyc Toasting Starbase panel and choose our Minecraft server. Next, we're going to choose the stop button to stop the server. Then from the Minecraft Tools drop-down menu, we're going to select Minecraft Jar. Depending on the preference, we're either going to select Forge Latest or Forge Recommended on the left-hand side. And then we're going to choose the desired Forge version we would like to install and click Install. We will then confirm the game version and choose Next. And then we have to choose what to do with the existing server files. Once we've done so, we can choose Next. Then we can press the confirm button. And once that's done installing, we can go back to the home tab, start our server, and we've installed Forge on our Minecraft server. We'll now go over how to install Forge manually. First, we're gonna go to the Forge website that I'll have linked in the description, and we're gonna choose which Minecraft version we're gonna be running. Once we've done so, we're gonna choose the installer button. We're gonna launch the Forge installer that we downloaded, and select Install Server. Then we're gonna change the installation location to a folder on our desktop. You can do this anywhere, but we're just gonna have it on our desktop for now. Once we've done so, we're gonna click OK. Once finished, we're gonna go to that folder on our desktop, and we're gonna right-click the .jar file in here and choose Rename. We'll then copy the name of the Forge version that we have downloaded. So we'll have the forge dash Minecraft version number dash forge version number dot jar. We're gonna copy that. If you don't see a jar, you can just skip this step. Then we're going to select all the files, right click and hover send to and choose compressed zipped folder. We can go ahead and minimize this for now. We'll come back to this later. And we're gonna log into our Bicyc Toasting Starbase panel and choose our Minecraft server. Next, we're going to choose the stop button to stop the server. Then from the Minecraft Tools tab, we're going to select Minecraft Jar. We will then select Custom on the left-hand side. And depending on the version, we're going to click Install next to the following options. If you are trying to install Forge with the Minecraft version 1.17 to 1.20.1, .1, we're gonna select the custom jar forge slash neo 1.17 to 1.20.1. And then any other version, we're gonna select the custom jar non neo forge slash forge 1.17 to 1.20.1. We're gonna click install next to which option we need to choose. Once we've done so, we can confirm the game version and hit next. Then choose what to do with the existing server files and choose Next. Finally, press the Confirm button. We're then going to wait for the installation to finish. Once it's finished, we're going to go to the Files tab. And we're going to upload that .zip file that we compressed earlier here onto the Files tab. Once that's installed, we can then right-click that .zip file and choose Unarchive. Once that's finished unarchiving, we're going to go to the Startup tab. And on the server jar file table, we're gonna input the .jar name that we copied from earlier. If there was no .jar file, we can just skip this step. Once we've done so, we can go to the home tab. And on the Java version table, we're gonna choose the appropriate version. Here is a table showing which version you need to choose compared to which Java version you need to select. So 1.16 and below, you're gonna choose Java 8. 1.17 to 1.20.1, .1, you're gonna select Java 17, and 1.20.2 .2 and above, you're gonna select Java 21. Java Adoptium is the default option, although some mod packs may perform better on other versions. Once we've changed this, we can choose the Start Server button, and we'll have installed Forge manually on our Minecraft server. Thanks for watching, and check out bisectoasting.com, your ultimate gaming partner.